Hey you guys, so like I've said, I've been putting together a Dollar Tree skincare routine so that I can test it and let you guys know if it works out. Cause how wonderful would it be if we could all use just Dollar Tree products on our skin? So I'm gonna go ahead and test out all of these things that I am gonna show you today for a few weeks and I'm gonna take before and after photos and hopefully I'll be able to edit by then to put them in video. I'm gonna try my best to learn. I'm working on it, you guys. It's hard to learn when you're when you have no clue about it. So I'm working on that. Let me just go ahead and get started. I'm gonna show you guys these products in the way that I would put them on my face, what I would use first and last, etc. So first I would take off my makeup. And what I do have for that right now is the facial wipes from Bolero. These ones are the tea tree oil ones. I really like them. You get 32 count in here. And I do like that they have this kind of an opening so that it stays fresh longer. Um, I do find that if you store these on the like face down, they do um, stay moist longer. So I don't know if that really works. I do that and I think it works. So if you store them face down, they would last longer. So I'm gonna use these for makeup removal, but I'm also gonna get the cleansing balm from Bolero. I just haven't been able to find it in my stores. I'm going to find it and I'm gonna get that to also use to add into this little routine. So after I take off my makeup, I would wash my face. So on days that I'm having a few breakouts, that I have a little bit of a problem, I'm gonna use the Pond's Pure Detox Facial Foam with charcoal. It is um, activated charcoal. So I'm gonna go ahead and use that on days that my skin is not doing so great. On days that it's clear and pretty good, I'm gonna use this facial cleanser from Bolero called Energy Boost with vitamin C and cucumber. That's what I'll be using on days that I don't use the Pond's. And for both of those, I'm gonna be using these face scrubbers. I figured I would give them a shot. I just picked them up today, but I'm gonna go ahead and give them a shot with the facial, with the facial care and see if it works. So I'm gonna give those a go. And then the next thing that I would do is tone. And I just picked up the Soothing Facial Toner from Bolero. It's rose water, rose water and aloe. So I just grabbed that to be my toner for both, day and night. And then for treatments, I'm going to be using, this should be no shock to anybody who's watched any of my videos, I'm gonna be using the Skin Nutrition's Botanicals Serums. So you get one is a retinol and one is hyaluronic acid. So you get hyaluronic acid 1% plus vitamin C and a double strength retinol night repair serum. So I'm gonna be using one in the morning, the hyaluronic acid in the morning and the retinol at night. And then I'm also going to be using some eye creams and an eye serum. So I did pick up the Skin Nutrition's eye serum with peptides, vitamins, and green tea, green tea extract, age defy dark circles, and puffiness serum. It says instant three-in-one treatment for dark circles, puffiness, fine lines, and wrinkles. So I went ahead and grabbed one of these to use as a serum under the eyes. I'm excited about the roller ball. That'll probably feel really good. And then I also got for the eye cream because that's just a serum to go underneath. It's not enough for me. I have very dry under eyes. So I also got the eye cream from Bolero, the hibiscus rose that says it refreshes, nourishes, and revives. So I went ahead and grabbed this today to add in as a eye cream. And then I'm also going to, of course, be using my new eye roller that I love. I love this thing. I think it's gonna be similar to the one on this, but I really do like having this to use with every eye cream. So I'll be using this in conjunction with this and let you guys know how that goes. So for the moisturizers, for my daily moisturizer, I'm gonna be using the Hyaluronic Acid from Global Beauty Care. It's just Hyaluronic, Hyaluronic Acid Skin Cream. And then at night, I'm going to be switching off between the Retinol Night Cream and the Aqua Sleeping Mask plus Hyaluronic Acid. I wanna see, I wanna use this and see if it's a um, dupe for the, for the Laneige Aqua Sleeping Mask. So I'm hoping that would be, that would be amazing because that's kind of pricey. A few extras that I also am gonna throw in is this Pink Sugar Lip Scrub from Global Beauty Care, along with the Lip Scrubber Tool from Dollar Tree. I love this thing. I'm also gonna be using the So Fresh So Clean Astringent, the Dynamic Drying Lotion with Calamine. I'm gonna be using this on any flare-ups that I happen to get. I'll also be using just the charcoal nose cleaning strips like I usually do. I usually use these, so I'm gonna keep using them, but I do really like the ones from the Dollar Tree and I'm gonna keep trying them. I've, I've used them a couple of times, so I wanna give it more of, a, more of a test so that I can really be sure to tell you guys what I think. 
I'm also gonna be using these more. I used them one time, but they're the April Bath and Shower Eye Pads. These ones were the Keeling Cucumber ones. I haven't seen these recently, but I, I did see them months ago, but um, I'm gonna go ahead and use these as well. I figure they're like the ones that they have right now that are the little puffy bags. I'm gonna try to get those too and have them in my fridge, but I'm also gonna be using these. These are the ones that looks like the little slice of cucumber that you put on your eye. They're very soothing. And also for the eye, I'm gonna be using the New Pore Moisturizing Eye Masks. I'm gonna be using those during the month to let you guys know if I see any difference with those or how they feel and if they you know, make a difference with my makeup or whatnot. And the last two things are masks. And of course, I'm gonna be using more than just two masks in the month, but I just got a two, um, a couple to show you. So I still, I have the Brighten Up Paper Facial Mask with Honey and Vitamin C from Bolero. And I also have the Pore Refining Hydrogel Face Mask from Global Beauty Care. So those are just the two that I have on hand. I'm gonna be purchasing more so that I can use the, like one a week for, for the time or maybe even two a week for the month that I use this so that I can really test these products and let you guys know how they go. I'm gonna be using these and only these. I'm not gonna add anything else to the skincare. I'm not going to try to fake and use good skincare and then tell you that the results were crazy. No, I'm gonna use just this for a month and then I'm gonna come back and let you guys know how it fared. How did, how did we do? Did anything work? Did some of it work? Did none of it work? You know, we're really gonna see. So if that's something that you guys think that you'd like to keep watching for, give me a thumbs up down below. Let me know if you guys are using any of this stuff right now or if you're using another kind of a product that I need to add to my routine, definitely put that down below. And if you're new and not subscribed yet, please subscribe, I'd love to have you here. And for all of my current subscribers, thank you so much for watching and to everybody until next time, take care.